What's up everyone? It's Kelly and today I've got a very exciting announcement for you. You've already seen the title and the thumbnail of this video so it's no surprise. Today I'm announcing a brand new collaboration with Starly and this time it is bigger than ever. We actually have eight brand new nail polishes. We even have this special edition collector's box and there's a little something extra in here as well. So let's just dive right into it. I am so excited to show these to you. These polishes have actually been in the works for over a year now, which is actually kind of crazy to think about. But before we get into that, if you haven't heard of Starly before, let me give you a little bit of information on them. They are an independent nail polish brand that is based out of the US, but they are available internationally. They are five free, meaning they are free of five of the potentially harmful ingredients that are often found in nail polish. They are vegan, meaning they do not use any animal derived ingredients, and they are cruelty free, meaning they do not test their products on animals. I am a huge fan of the brand. As you guys probably know, if you've watched me for any length of time, I absolutely absolutely adore their polishes. This is actually my fourth year of doing collabs with them. And oh man, we have some really beautiful shades for you. Not only do we have some exciting new colors, but I also have finishes I have never done before. So like I said, we've got eight brand new polishes. We have four different finishes. So there are two holographic duochrome shimmers. We have two iridescent flaky jellies. We've got two toppers. And this time we've got two cream finishes. I've actually never done a cream finish for a collab before, but once you guys see the formula of these, you are just going to be blown away because I am blown away by them. <laughs> like I said, we also have this special edition collector's box. It's called the Galaxy Crate. It's this really beautiful space themed box. We even have a little Kelly astronaut on the back with some galaxy hair. Within the box set, you get the eight brand new polishes. They are all space themed, of course. And then we also have a special little gift that comes with the box set. So this is actually another thing that we've been working on for a really long time. I don't know if you guys actually know this about me, but I'm a huge enamel pin collector. My purse is actually covered in enamel pins and I have been wanting to put this on my purse for so long, but it's this adorable little galaxy gang pin. It's got this astronaut riding a star and holding a flag that says galaxy gang. Very adorable. I absolutely love it. I hope you do too. And as a little added bonus, I did sign 600 of these cards. So the first 600 people to order the full box set are going to get a little signed Kelly Marissa card with my little astronaut pin on it. So I'm sure you guys are eager to see the polishes. I am very eager to show them to you. So let me show you all of the swatches of the eight polishes and then we'll talk a little bit more about pricing and availability and all that good stuff. So roll the footage. Of course I am going to be using base coat underneath all of my swatches as I always do just to protect my natural nail and prevent any stains. Today I am using the Starly Guardian base coat so I'll link it below as well. So let's just dive right into it. I'm going to start off with the duochrome shimmery hollows. This first one is called Spiral and it is the most stunning medium blue base that has this really intense duochrome shifting shimmer in there. So in certain angles it looks like it's this very intense fuchsia color and then in other angles more extreme lighting it looks like it's actually this vibrant lime green color. And as you can see this is one coat coverage on my short nails. Of course if you have long nails you'll probably need a second coat but that is just one thing that I love about Starly. Their polishes manage to be very creamy and self-leveling and easy to use but they're also incredibly opaque so just in absolute awe of this one you can see there's this really nice subtle holographic shimmer running throughout as well so with direct lighting you get a little bit of that rainbowy sparkle too and there's just so much color going on just depending on how you move your hand around you're going to either see that really strong violet or that really strong green and it's just a fun time. So I also have full hand swatches of each color because I took pictures for the Starly website. So I figured I would just throw them into the review to show you. These are all pictures with indirect lighting. So it really just looks different depending on the lighting, but I am just absolutely in love with this color. And then we have the second duochrome shimmer. This one is called Luminous and I'm really excited about this one. I mean, to be honest, I'm excited about all of them, but the reason I'm very excited about Luminous is because I have never done a collab shade 
remotely like this. And I absolutely love wearing yellow, especially when it verges into like gold territory. So I'm just really happy we were able to come up with one that just feels so perfect on my nails. So it's this really intense, warm yellow base. And then we have this duochrome shimmer in there, which in some lightings looks like a yellowy gold. And then in other lightings, it's this really intense orange. So it's actually kind of hard to tell on camera. I think it's a lot more visible in person, but you'll see in the picture a little bit more of that orangey shimmer in there. And then again, we have that really nice, subtle holographic sparkle that just adds another layer of dimension to the polish. And I was really excited because this one is actually a two coater on me and yellow nail polishes tend to be three coats. So just the really impressive formula that Starly always makes managed to impress me yet again to nobody's surprise. But again, if you do have longer nails, you might need a third coat for this one because yellow polishes are notoriously difficult to get very opaque. But yeah, just an absolutely stunning shade. Obviously, I'm going to say that because I helped make it, but I mean, I'm just in love with it. Okay, so moving on to the next exciting finish, I actually have two cream finishes in this collection. And if you have ever tried a cream finish from Starly, you'll probably understand why. They just have this really incredible formula. And there were a couple of colors that I felt like would be such perfect creams to have in their very creamy, one coat formula. So this first shade is called Gravity and it is just my ideal cool toned medium purple cream shade. As you can see, this one is full coverage in the first coat on me. I am wearing it in the intro and outro of this video with one of the toppers on it and I am actually wearing one coat and it is just so impressive. It's so easy and smooth and creamy. I mean, I can't say enough good things about this formula, but I just feel like it's also my favorite purple color. Like this is my ideal purple to wear on my nails. You guys probably know I always love a very cool toned purple that almost leans a little bit blue. So I'm sure it's not a surprise to anybody that I came up with this color, but I'm just absolutely in love with it. And then the other cream finish that I have is this really beautiful medium gray cream that's called Crater. And the reason behind this one is I was really searching for very specific shade of gray in a cream formula. I wanted a medium toned neutral gray cream. and. I feel like all of my favorites are either super light gray or super dark gray. And I actually wear gray all the time. It's kind of like the neutral color that I always go for even more than nude shades. And I just really wanted this very specific color. And again, it just has this really amazing formula. It's one coat coverage on me. It's like the perfect undertone. So it's not cool and it's not warm. So it really suits any skin tone. I mean, I feel like I say that a lot, but honestly, any nail polish really suits any skin tone, but I just feel like, I don't know, I'm just very happy with how this one turned out. It's just my ideal gray polish. Moving on to the two topper finishes, this first shade is called Star Cluster, and oh my goodness, this one is a whole lot packed into one bottle. So we have a whole rainbow of iridescent irregular flakies in there. Then we have these really tiny gold holographic micro glitters, and then there's also a subtle golden shimmer running throughout. So I'm just showing you what it looks like on the naked nail. It's this really soft, delicate color, but because of that golden shimmer and hollow in there, it also actually kind of is a vibe over the naked nail or over the lighter colors. Of course, iridescent flakies really pop over deeper colors. So I'm going to show you over my beautiful shade Gravity. And this is just the combo that I am absolutely living for. This is what I'm wearing in the intro and outro. And I just love how magical and ethereal it is. Honestly, I don't always love seeing iridescent flakes over a medium or lighter colors, but I just think this combination really works so well. And I absolutely love this shade over lighter colors. So showing you over white really quick, just so you can see how bright and warm it is. All of that golden shimmer and hollow glitter in there just really adds a little something extra to it. But then with those iridescent flakies over white, they look so cool toned. So it's this really nice contrast. I absolutely love them together over white. There's just something so fun about it and definitely very different from anything that I own. And of course, when you wear it over a deep color like black, it is completely transformative and it honestly looks like such a party on the nails. All of that iridescent flaky color really comes out and you can see all of the different colors of iridescent flake in there. We've got the whole rainbow and then we also have the hollow in there to just add a little layer of dimension and it's still very 
very warm because of all of that golden shimmer in there too. So honestly, pretty much a vibe over any color or even on its own. And it really transforms based on what you wear it over. So it's definitely been a lot of fun to experiment with this one. And the other topper is pretty much the exact opposite of Star Cluster. This one is called Callisto and it's this really beautiful, intense, dark, multi-chrome, flaky topper. So I'm going to show you guys over the naked nail first, just so you can see what the color looks like on its own. This is a multi-chrome shard. So it's very different from the iridescent flakies in that it doesn't shift color based on what you're putting it over. It already has the color in there. So it's already a very solid color, but it still looks really cool over different shades. So there's a lot of color going on in this one. It is a pure multi-chrome. There's no hollow in this one. It shifts from blue to purple. And then you even get to see a little bit of pink and gold in there as well, just kind of depending on how you're moving your hand. So it's definitely a lot of fun. And the idea behind this one, I don't know if you guys remember this from my last collab, but I had two really beautiful multi-chrome toppers called Phobos and Deimos. And they were named after the two moons of Mars. And they had a really nice holographic sparkle running throughout as well. And I wanted to have a similar shade, but not exactly like a sister shade to them. I wanted them to have like a little cousin. So we came up with Callisto, who is one of the moons of Jupiter. And I just feel like if you're looking for a pure, deep multi-chrome, this is absolutely the color for you. It's just a lot of fun. I love how dark it is. And that's why we decided to skip the hollow on this one, just because I wanted to keep it feeling a little bit more mysterious and magical. So it's definitely a lot of fun, honestly, over any color. I feel like the videos are not even doing this shade justice. There's just so much color shifting going on in there that ends up being a lot of fun. And of course, you can really see what I mean when I'm pairing it over black, just when I'm talking about like how deep and mysterious it is. Just over black, it looks so cool and like lit from within. And this is also a topper that you can sponge on if you want to make it full coverage. And it also has a very cool look. So I can show you guys what that looks like very soon. Maybe I'll post it on Instagram. So here's just a quick comparison of the three multi-chrome toppers. The first two shades on the left and in the middle are from my 2020 collab with them. On the left, we have Phobos. In the middle, we have Deimos. And then now on the right, we have Callisto, my new deep ethereal color. So honestly, they're all a lot of fun. I feel like you can really play with all of them in different ways. And you can also play with them together because they all are a little bit different from each other, but they still match. Then we have the final two shades and these are iridescent flaky jelly polishes. So this first shade is called the Crab. It is this really beautiful, intense blue jelly base. So jelly meaning that you can still see a little bit of that visible nail line through and it adds a lot of depth to the polish when you layer it up. So you can almost see all of the layers of those iridescent flakies in there and just how magical and color shifty they are in that blue base. And of course, we do have some holographic sparkle in here as well, just because I couldn't resist, but it is just a really stunning color. It feels like a magical underwater shade. So the naming of this one and the next shade are really fun. I named this one the crab because if you guys didn't know, my zodiac sign is cancer, which is the crab. And I also also felt like this was a nice magical underwater kind of color. And also blue is actually my favorite color. I know this is probably a lesser known fact because purple is my favorite nail polish color. So that's a color I always talk about on my channel, but blue is my everyday favorite color, like my general favorite color. So I thought it just fit really well that my zodiac sign inspired color would be blue. So I also wanted to show you what it looked like matte just because it's a lot of fun being able to see all of that iridescent sparkle in there with a matte top coat is just very magical. And then the final shade, last but not least, we have the shade, the scales. This is my other iridescent jelly polish. And this one is this really beautiful, very cool toned green jelly base. And again, we have all of those iridescent flakies running throughout in every color. And then we also have that very subtle holographic sparkle in there. So the name of this one is actually the scales for 
for the zodiac sign for Libra, which is what my boyfriend Ryan is. And fun fact, his favorite color is green. And you guys know there aren't enough green nail polishes in the world. So I thought it would be the perfect combination to name the green Libra polish for him. And then another little added bonus that I thought about was because the polish also kind of looks a little bit like dragon scales or snake scales because of this really beautiful deep green and then we have that iridescent shimmer going on in there. I just thought that was like kind of a cool double name. So it's like the scales for Libra, but also the scales for dragons or snakes or mythical creatures. So just a lot of fun. And again, I did mattify it just because that is also a very fun time. <laughs> so here are all of the shades together. I feel like it's so funny because I really stuck within the same type of color story that I always go for. And yet the colors of this feel so different from what I usually do for collabs. So I just had a lot of fun with these. Also, since I did do full hand swatch picks, I figured I would also show you guys a collage of all of these swatches together. And I am just so in love with these. I love the colors. I love the matching collector's box. I love the formulas. They are just so impressive and easy to work with and a lot of fun. And I mean, of course I love them because I helped create them. So they're just very special to my heart. So those are the polishes and I am just so incredibly happy with how they turned out. I truly love every single one of these shades. I hope you guys do too. It was such an incredible experience to get to make them. And I feel like Starly just goes above and beyond every single one of my ideas and somehow manages to make every color even better than I could have imagined. You know, not only in the way that they look, but just in having such an incredible formula as well. They always just impress me. I'm so incredibly honored to be able to put my name on some of their beautiful creations. So just a really wonderful experience. And again, I, I just hope you guys love them as much as I do. So each of these polishes come in 15 milliliter bottles. You can get the full box set with all eight polishes and the little pin, and that retails for $125 USD. The polishes are also available individually. So the specialty finishes retail for $16.50 USD, and the creams retail for $14.50 USD each. I do also have a 10% off code with Starly. You can use the code Kelly to get 10% off your order there. So I'm gonna link everything down in the description. You can check that out if you're interested in picking them up. And like I said, the first 600 orders of the full box set are going to get a signed pin card. But yeah, I just can't believe that the time is finally here to be able to share this with you guys. Like I said, this is something we've been working on for so long. And I just have to say, it is such an incredible experience to get to do this. And it's really all because of you guys. So I really just want to take a quick moment to thank you guys so much for your love and support. Being a part of this community honestly just means so much to me. You guys are incredibly special to me. I really do love being able to talk with you guys, you know, having conversations, answering your comments. Even those of you guys who don't comment, who just watch my videos, I am so incredibly grateful for you. And it just makes me feel so special and so loved. Uh, and that's, oh gosh, I'm gonna cry. It, it means a lot to me to have you guys as part of my life. So thank you guys so much. But yeah, that is it for my collaboration with Starly. I really hope you guys enjoyed them. I would love to hear your thoughts. Please let me know in the comments. I am just so nervous and excited to share these with you. So yeah, I just, I wanna hear from you. I want to hear from the community. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. And if you enjoy the polishes and if you enjoy me, please give this video a thumbs up. It lets me know I'm doing a good job. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. I put out new videos every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. Huge shout out to my Cosmic Admirals on Patreon, Amanda M, Braxton Scott, and Rocket Man's daughter. I really appreciate your support. I love you all so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. So you guys probably already know the drill by now. I usually share a fun fact at the end of every video, but as is customary when I release a collaboration, I usually just skip the fun fact just because I feel like the whole video and, you know, the naming and everything is a fun fact. But I will share a collab related fun fact with you guys. The first shade that we came out with for this collection was Spiral, the beautiful blue dual chrome that has that holographic shimmer. That was actually a polish that we came up with a while back 
back, oh my gosh, I want to say like July-ish 2020. Obviously it was just a little sample version that they mixed together. The polishes are all very fresh, don't worry. But yeah, we first came up with that concept a really long time ago, like a year and a half ago, and I was just absolutely stunned by the polish. We were actually going to include it as a part of the 2020 collab that I did with them. But if you guys have seen the 2020 collection, those colors are a very different vibe. So we ended up tabling that polish, but I just never got it out of my mind. It was a polish that I could not stop thinking about. So as soon as they came to me and offered to do another collab for 2021, that was the first thing that I wanted them to recreate. So I'm really glad I finally get to share it with you guys. It is a polish that I have been loving and wanting to share for so long. So that polish has a very special place in my heart. Although to be fair, they all do. But yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.